Wish my horse looked that night. First things first, if you hear me spluttering the most agonizing cough ever, I appear to have what Arthur Morgan had. No, I don't have tuberculosis. I, I, I have AIDS. No, I just have a cough. It just seems to be getting about locally at the moment. Got a bit of a cough going on, um, which... What do you mean, crime reported? What? You bastard lawman, right? Fuck this. Is there a party I wasn't invited to? Death to the west. Alrighty, so, somebody pulled me aside and told me that maybe that wasn't the best way to deal with a, um, false accusation of illegal activities. So, I guess we're on the path to reforming our lives, you see. We, and by we, I mean John Marston, we used to be a outlaw. But now we've put that life behind us, haven't we? So, I guess we're lawful men now. So, I guess we're gonna have to go and do some totally lawful things. <laughs> You're damn fucking right I am. Well, that seemed to work. Right, okay. As good as anything does. So the first step in becoming a lawful man, we need to we need to get the heat off our backs. So we're going to have to get a new look. Right. Lovely. Let's go. I'm bolder than a porn star's testicle. It's amazing. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, I am Farmer John Marston. Listen here, kids. I've just had a trim. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm trying to turn my life around here, you fucking wanker. Okay, I shot his face off. You think you can kill a bald man like that? Retard. Fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. Really? Really? I'm just trying to be a lawful man starting a new life somewhere. Look at me. What, what, what am I going to do? I'm just an innocent bald man. With a sawn-off shotgun, right. I surrender. I'll come. Don't no, shoot. That's it. I'm bringing you in now. I surrender. I'm being lawful. Man, you feel real stupid now, huh? Yeah, pretty stupid. Oh, <laughs> I'm in jail. This is a good time to reflect. I just realised something. I killed three people, and I'm still fucking bold, even though they've released me from prison. How long was I in there? Do you have a barber in prison? Somebody who keeps me bold? Um, is my horse not dead? Let's have a look. My horse does not appear to be dead. It would appear as if I have not served time for this. You know what? I'm actually digging the complete bowl look. I, I didn't think I would, but fuck it. Enjoy the show. If my facial hair was long enough to have mutton chops, believe it's me, I would show. have them. So don't come asking for a refund. I just don't like how much time you're spending with the man is all. Just wait until you see his work. It's very... I think the most amazing thing here is I can just whip my gun out and shoot people. But instead, I'm going to have to do this the civilized way. Pusher. Search the gallery for Charles. Charles, where are you? I think that it's Greek. It doesn't have a penis. It's not Greek. I think that's our guy. Excuse me, Mr. Chatonet. Couldn't you have painted some drawers on her? Madame, I paint her in her natural state. As she was and will be in paradise. There's nothing natural about that. Clothes are civilization, repression, death. To be naked is to be free, innocent, alive. Like Buddha said, you know, we are all just here to fuck. <laughs> well, that explains the decadence of those Hottentots. Hey, you got a picture of my wife here. In her delicate. <gasps> Henry, oh. is that your behind? Why would you be showing it to that man? That's my mama. As nude as the day she was born. Stop looking at my husband's buttocks. Stop looking at my mama. Well, maybe she shouldn't expose herself like that. <laughs> Disgusting. A nerve on you. That's it. Oh, come on, Mildred. This is no place for us. Come here, hey. I am a bitch. Oh, you filthy little man. Oh. 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 What? I'm coming after you, Frenchie. Hey. Right. No, don't get- no, we're trying to be civilized. Stop it, you dickhead. Stop getting me into scraps that I don't want to be in. Right, I'm gonna bang out everyone. 
just gonna punch indiscriminately. Fuck him. Get off me, you fucking dodgy twat. Okay, goodbye. So much for civilized. I'm gonna have to get my hair cut again. Oh, wait. Oh, <laughs> shit. I'm gonna have to get a wig. You know what? I'm keeping the bold look. I've decided it's funny as fuck. My angel, my little bird, it's me. Well, here we are. A new <laughs> What a fucking psychotic nincompoop. Uh, okay. Right, well. I think that was a... I think that was a job well done. Though I have no idea why I did it. Alrighty then. Okay, so we've got the, the trim, we've got the shave, and now we just need to find a lovely, lovely suit. I still have a bandolier on, but it, I look formal now. I look like I could be an authority figure. Come on, people. Let me vote. Hilda, marry me, please. I have no idea who the fuck you are, and you're like three times my age. You, my friend, what do you think about women's suffrage? Women voting? Sure. Why not? Oh, thank you, sir. You are a true progressive. I mean, anyone dumb enough to want to vote, go right ahead. Oh, a cynic. How dull for you. I do hope you grow out of it, young man. It's so unappealing. It's all right. I'm not attracted to fucking pensioners anyway. That they are the equal of I named him a horse Megatron. Goodbye. Me and Megatron are gonna go and fight the the good fight. Oh. She literally just poured shit on you. You know, this hat is sort of outstaying its welcome on me. I have a better alternative. Right. Let's go slay some fucking dragons. Because that's an honourable, lawful thing to do. I feel like I'm owed a trip. Away from Saint Denis, the place where lawful people gather. I've got the perfect cabin in the woods. Hey, mister. Have you seen my dog? I I've been looking everywhere for her. She's been gone for hours. Can you help me find her? Please? Fuck off. Sorry, if I'm to be a lawful bloke, I cannot dabble in the engagements with the likes of Scum of Strawberry, the most aggressive people in the world. Oh dear. We have been in an accident that wasn't our fault, and our horse is fine, so it doesn't matter. That's exactly the problem, sir. You're on my land. Holy shit, that's a bear. Now it's a dead bear. I'll live out the rest of my life in self-imposed exile in this gaff up the road. Here we are, home sweet home. Let's go inside. Die! What the shit? Fuck's sake, Gareth. I said don't bring any bears in. Oh god, what's the point in having a housekeeper if you invite bears into the house? How did it even get in here? That thing's fatter than a whale. What? My head's shiny. Look at my bald head, it's shiny. <laughs> <laughs> 